Good morning, guys. So you guys chose on Instagram that you would like a day in the life with all my pets um, next. So that is what we're filming today. <laughs> So I usually start by turning my fish tank on and I will feed them if they need to be fed. I don't feed them every day though, so this particular day I did not. So it's around 11 something and I have turned on my bearded dragon's tank. He always, I turn his on first. The snakes I don't always turn on. And then the spiders, I don't really mess with them until later on. So Tut probably consumes most of my pet maintenance. It's just like as soon as I turn the light on, it's a disaster in there. Usually there's like poop everywhere and he has like wilted food so it needs to be replaced. I usually feed him fresh turnip greens or fresh collard greens. Of course I wash it first and he really seems to enjoy these. So since he is an adult basically now, I do not give him as much protein anymore. I usually coat some super worms with some calcium powder though every couple days or so. And as you can see, he totally loves super worms. That's probably his favorite. I will be feeding my crested gecko next and right now he is eating mulberry madness rupashi this is a little bit different than the normal kind I wanted to try it out and he seems to really be enjoying it as you will see here shortly I usually don't pull him out to feed him but I wanted to for this video so that you guys could see him I think he's gonna be shedding soon so that's why he's a little dull in color but he looks so cute, so hope you enjoy these shots. So this particular day, I did not have to mess with the snakes. All of them ate two days ago, so I just kind of wait for them to go to the bathroom, and then we will end up scooping out the poop and feeding them again. I usually don't really do anything for the tarantulas until much later, usually around like 7 p.m. So what I do is kind of look and see how everybody is. So I found out that this particular one molted. This is my Blue Dwarf Beauty. And then I also found out my Caribbean Versi color molted as well. So I made sure to give them both some extra water. I really just kind of want to make sure mainly that my slings have like some decent moisture. I like to keep them a little bit more damp. I usually like to keep like one side of the enclosure somewhat moist. So that is what I mainly look out for just to kind of see who could use a little bit of a spray. And I do this pretty much every day. Also, I just kind of throw in pieces of like food, just like scraps that the roaches would like. And my dead leaf mantis also eats every couple days, so today was an eat day, and I just offered some flightless fruit flies, which I really hate messing with these, but it seems to really enjoy munching them. I 
Also don't feed my Halloween moon crabs every day, but I do like to check for mold because I have problems with that forming. They seem to really enjoy taking like old food and dragging it like under the water bowl or something and I just really don't like that. So I kind of like to dig through their enclosure a little bit as frequently as I can. And then this particular time I fed them some cat food because they do need protein. Also, I just took Willow out for a little bit to say hello, and that is it. That is all the pet maintenance that I did this particular day. All right, so it is the next day, and I just kind of wanted to wrap up the video. Yesterday was a pretty normal day. That's basically what I do every single day. Of course, there are days where I have bigger projects I have to do on top of that. Sometimes we have to feed all the snakes. Sometimes we have a bearded dragon cleaning day or he has to have a bath. Of course, there are times where I have to feed my tarantulas. So it definitely varies. Um, but as for just like a regular routine day, um, yes, that is about everything I have to do. I always felt like I really didn't do that much, but I guess I do actually do more than I thought every day. It is, it does kind of seem like a lot, no, a lot of maintenance now, but it's just so routine to me that it doesn't feel like a lot of work. Also, I have a really awesome collab coming out Friday, so stay tuned for that. There is a Show Me Snakes show on Sunday, October 21st. And we are having a food drive. Ruth from Mostly Reptiles will be there. So if you are in the St. Louis area, you should come. I will be there probably around like 10 or 11 and I'm gonna stick around and do a little bit of filming and stuff. I am picking up one new addition that I know of. We'll see if there's anything else. Kind of trying to take it easy, but we'll see. And then I have another awesome collab coming out the following Friday. So a lot of things to look for. In the meantime, I hope you guys enjoyed this, like this video. Subscribe if you're not and you want to be. And I will see you guys in my next.